Yo, what's good everybody? A Rob Brooker 27 here, and today I'm going to be telling you guys my NBA Live Mobile Season 5 wish list. So, I mean, there's a lot of people that have made videos of this. I mean, there's a lot of stuff that this game definitely needs help with. Definitely, you know, a lot of people have quit over the past few years because of many of the things EA has removed from the game or even included. I think the game is so much worse compared to season one because season one was by far the best season and it i i wouldn't say it's progressively gone worse every year but like i i just feel like it's it's just going down a little bit as of right now because nba live season four is the game's a bit dead right now so hopefully season five will be much better but i'll be telling you guys my season five wish list Okay, so my first idea, well, not really idea, because it's definitely <laughs> most of these stuff are going to be borrowing from season one. But the first thing is to have masters for every single main game mode on NBA Live Mobile. So what I'm saying is there's uh, pictures up here of a league versus league master, um, a showdown master, and then there's also a yearly master. I just think if you have masters for every game mode, it will make people want to play and it's not there, there's a lot of times in season four where you will finish the program or like the new promo and you get the master and then you just have absolutely nothing to do like once you're finished you can work on getting these masters because people can play what they want maybe if you prefer showdown more than arena and or season mode more than showdown then you can go for the master that is part of the game mode you want to play because if you like season you're not gonna get anything out of season mode because they're the rewards are so bad and then showdown nobody wants dust as a reward or i think they're shards now nobody wants those people want players to actually get and if you have if you start the game off with high overall masters, then people will push for those at the beginning. The next thing EA needs to make more of are coin packs. I mean, we voiced our opinions as a community that we want to be able to open up packs and EA just like never listened to us in that part of the game. I mean, everyone likes opening up packs because like you never know what you're gonna get. And I mean, that's basically what it is they're just fun to open you can if you get a big pool it's absolutely amazing if you don't get anything then i mean it's not the end of the world but give us packs that's all we want literally packs because season one was filled with awesome pack openings you know like qjb loves opening packs you can get all kind of program players when you open up the packs and i mean there's once new packs come out everyone's opening them up but now it's like it's really hard for like even me to get like decent um, a decent amount of packs. Like I know we got those 103 plus finals players, but you can, there's a limit of them, only seven, and you can't really do anything. You you can upgrade your team with them, but what I'm trying to say is that like you, you you're not gonna get like good packs from the store. Basically, they're just taunting us with like really good packs in the store but we're not gonna be able to get any of it. And in season one, we were able to get a lot of the packs that were in the store. It just, I mean, if we didn't buy anything, we'd, they'd still, we'd still be able to obtain many of those packs by doing objectives and doing sets and stuff. So EA, please bring back packs. And the last thing I wanted to go over is please fix the auction house. I mean, literally it is impossible to sell like anything i mean you can sell high overalls or new cards that come out but if you have like a 95 overall you're not gonna sell it no matter how hard you try it's basically impossible and that's because the auction house is run by bots by ea and it's dumb because the auction house should be you know controlled by the players we, there shouldn't be any bots i know a lot of people took control of you know being able to sell coins off that but you're just gonna have to deal with it it's gonna get a lot of people like people can't even make coins off the promos now because even a lot of the stuff are even unauctionable 
But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, let me know if you guys agreed with what I said or what you think or uh, what else would help with the game. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching. See ya.